Hello everyone and welcome. Today we're going to be reviewing a fan heater. It's the Dyson Hot and Cold model, uh, or the sorry, the Dyson Hot and Cool AM05. Uh, the latest one out now is the AM09. This particular one, the AM05, is 2000 watt fan heater. So we'll start off just by talking through some of the controls here on the bottom. The fan does come with a remote but I've lost it, I don't seem to be able to find it. You can replace them, and they are about £30 for a new remote, and I don't think it's really worth it. The remote has the same features as uh, the functions on the actual fan itself. Uh, to start off with, we've got the power button on off here. Then we'll have your fan speeds. Um, in your center here you get a display of either the fan speed or your temperature or, your, or sorry your thermostat that you set it to then you've got the temperature here or the thermostat settings here and then the oscillate button uh, so if I put it on you can see here that the fan is set to uh, 37 degrees but the, temp the, the thermostat is set to 37 degrees and I can crank it down, all the way down to zero degrees uh, Celsius. And what it will do in that case is it won't use the heating elements at all and it will just try to operate as a fan. When it's working as just a regular flat fan on its own, it does get quite loud at the maximum. So I'm gonna turn it up here. So you get a you can go from one all the way up to ten. So we've got ten increments of fan speed. When we change it into the here we go into the heating mode, you can hear it will drop down. Uh, there we go. Just turn it up. and it won't operate at quite the speed of the regular fan mode. It does get still pretty loud. Um, with the oscillation, there we go. That's it. It heats the room pretty quickly, um, which is quite good. And in terms of cooling, I don't think it's it's not very good. It's just a little bit of comfort. It's not really going to cool cool you down the room or cool you off too much. Um, it does kick out the heat pretty well. It gives out a good stream of warm air. That's got like a constant flow to it, which is very good. As opposed to a radiator, an oil radiator, electric radiator, which just kind of warms the air around it and has more of a stagnant heat to it this one kind of flows through the room and that's how it heats the room up so quickly because it pushes the hot air around the room so what the fan or the heater does is that it will pull the air in through the uh, these vents here and then as it pushes it up it will heat up the air and with heating elements in here and then through this rim that surrounds the uh, wings here, it will push out the air. It's also got uh, additional heating elements inside here to keep the air hot and heat it up even more. This version is the nickel on nickel colour scheme. Uh, you get lighter colours, you can get uh, white or a light grey with a blue or, uh, or dark grey with a blue as well. This one is pretty shiny. It, mine is is quite dirty because uh, we just leave it sitting around. And I don't really use it in, in winter now. Uh, I managed to get mine second hand which I was quite pleased about uh, because it is a premium product and it does they do come on quite a high price. I've seen it going for between 300 to 500 pounds. It depends on availability and where you shop around so the prices do vary quite 
drastically. Thanks for watching. I'll put a link to the product below. Uh, be an Amazon affiliate link, so it does help the channel if you use it. And if you would be so kind to give me a like and a subscribe, it would be much appreciated. Bye bye.